So I want to go over something real quick, which is just getting Dolphin to launch from Emulation Station. I'm not going to go over setting up controllers or anything like that. Uh, I'll Maybe I'll do a video in the future on that. But this is just getting Emulation Station to launch Dolphin. So the first thing you want to do is download Dolphin, obviously. Uh, I suggest using the development builds. Uh, the development builds are more up to date. They're a lot more efficient for your CPU uh, than the stable builds. So get that downloaded, get it installed. Uh, if you watched my other video, uh, which I suggest watching first, which is setting up Emulation Station with Windows, then you'll already have your folder set up just like this uh, with all of your uh, emulators in one folder, which uh, is going to come in handy if you use my, my config file, which I'm going to show you. Um, so you get Dolphin extracted. Uh, that's done. You don't have to worry about that. Next thing you're going to need to do is get it set up in your config file. Um, which you can you can download my config file if you want from my other video which is uh, again setting up emulation station with windows or you can type it up yourself it looks just like this uh, this is for gamecube you can do the same thing for Wii um, now the way I have it set up is where I uh, put dolphin the the whole dolphin directory if you put it somewhere else then you're obviously just gonna have to change this um, and then the path is where the ROMs are. So if you put your ROMs into a different folder, then you're going to have to do this differently as well. Everything else should be fine. Um, once you've done that, once you've got uh, Dolphin installed, once you've got your systems config file set up, and once you have at least one ROM, uh, everything should work properly when you open up Emulation Station. You might not be able to see it because for some reason uh, full screen doesn't show up on, on my screen recorder. But I'm in Emulation Station right now and I'm launching a ROM. And as you can see, it opens up just fine. I'm going to press a button to continue just to show you. Uh, it launches just like this. And if you want to make a full screen, you can hit Alt Enter. Or if you have a controller, you can you know, set up some hotkeys so that you don't have to use the keyboard. But I hit Alt Enter and it goes full screen. And that's all you really need to do to connect Dolphin to Emulation Station.